Touchdown in Benny Dom! Oi oi! <laughs> Gonna go for a walk. See what's about. It's pretty busy here. Uh, and it's Sunday night and it's the beginning of April. So I can't imagine what it's like in actually peak season. But yeah, let's go check it out. <laughs> see why people go here because it's like a really good night out in the sun um it was massive i couldn't believe how big it was we were walking ages and we still didn't cover it all and it was so busy and this is the beginning of april you know imagine it in peak season god but there's plenty of bars to go around there's so many i couldn't believe it but uh one night was enough for me i think <laughs> I had to go find somewhere quiet uh, last night and I, I found this really nice spot overlooking the sea, it's beautiful. Uh, so I'm gonna go for a little walk now and check it out. <laughs> shopping for the first time since I've been here actually I've been living off two to four squares of dark chocolate and coffee uh, but I did have a packet of rice and a packet of beans so one night I trekked myself to a bean and rice dish with a load of spices and a, like a I made like a, a spicy sauce for it which was actually quite nice um, but yeah I'm completely out but also actually I have found some protein powder in the van so I have I've had that yesterday and today which has been lovely nice little treat but um, at the minute it's like do I spend money on food or fuel and I'd rather spend on fuel so uh, but no I do need to get some food in I need to actually eat properly now um, and I need to do my, some laundry some washing so 
<laughs> I've got these like dry bags that you put water in and uh, your, your, your laundry detergent um, and you just kind of mix it around. Oh, and you get like the, the two dryer balls with the, with the bobbly bits on and you like gr mix it around and grind it all and it's um, it it washes your clothes really well apparently so I'm gonna actually try that there are laundrettes all over but um, there's only a few little bits to wash so and I'd rather keep on top of it than have a massive pile so I'm gonna try that out and see how well it does also they said if you just leave it in your bathroom while you're driving it'll kind of wash it for you so I'm quite looking forward to seeing how that turns out guys let me just show you the spot I've got for the night Nice to have a proper meal. You can have tuna cheese and feta salad. Yes, you are correct. I have got double cheese in this, but who's here to tell me I can't? Exactly. Find Piggy. Good boy! Yay! <laughs> Clever boy! It's raining so we're playing hide and seek. Once the rain had stopped, we found a nice walk with a big lake and to our surprise we saw loads of flamingos.
please. really busy couple of days been to Alicante to meet my friend Faye because she happens to be here at the same time which is so cool and met her friends who are also really cool and had a photo shoot this morning in Torrevieja I think that's how you pronounce it uh, but it was a sunrise beach swimwear suit all right hooks <laughs> it was a sunrise uh, sunrise beach shoot uh, so that was an early start but it was really cool we, we got lucky with the weather and now i've just got to la Cuna rosa the pink lake the suspense was killing me to see this pink lake and then So the pink lake isn't that pink. <laughs> some parts it kind of had a pink hue to it but mainly it just looked brown. Oh well, the next spot definitely made up for it. And the moon that night was unreal. We headed into town and saw this 16th century watchtower overlooking the sea. It's a nice place with lots of bars and restaurants. The Alicante area has been one of my favourite places to visit so far. But the mountains in Murcia were calling us, so our next stop was there. Thanks for watching this one guys, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!